The Vatican has decided to release this material in order to clarify questions regarding Pope Pius XII's role during the build-up to World War II. Pius, the wartime pope, has been accused of doing too little to stop the Holocaust. Underneath the Vatican lies a bunker containing 50 miles of shelf space filled with documents dating back centuries. Few of the hundreds of tourists that visit the Vatican every day are aware of the existence of this bunker. But it's regarded around the world as an important source of material for historians. Not all the documents have been released for public viewing and study, though. Now the prefect of the secret archive says the Vatican wants the world to know the truth about the Holy See and the rising Nazi party. The documents date from 1922 to 1939 and are predominantly material from the Vatican's embassy in Munich and Berlin. Prior to becoming Pope, Pius XII, then Cardinal Pacelli, served as papal ambassador to Germany. Critics say he was pro-German and that that influenced his papacy. In a scathing book entitled Hitler's Pope, the author John Cornwell examines the pontiff's silence during the Holocaust, his reluctance to criticize Nazism, and his failure to block the deportation of Italian Jews. But supporters of the Pope insist that he made every effort possible to help Jews and other victims using quiet diplomacy. The release is the Vatican's response to demands by Jewish groups for access to the archives.